Okay, and we are with another beautiful lady who actually was one of the, what, how, how should I say, what exactly are you called when you want this thing and you're for sale? Bachelorette. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. She was one of the bachelorettes last year. And I want to ask you because I know, I understand that this year, first of all, your name is Martha and how do you pronounce your last name? Navarrete. Navarrete. Uh -huh. Where's that from? Mexico. I'm in love. <laughs> anyway, um, so as I was saying, I understand that this year you helped get some of these people here, some of the bachelors right. and bachelorettes. Uh -huh. What exactly did you have to do to convince these people to come here? Um, well, first of all, I I felt that my friends, I, they were my friends, and it was such a great, I had such a great time, I got to meet good people, and I felt like I was doing a good thing, that instead of just me doing it, I thought if I helped more people get involved, it'd be good for the Lisa Merlin House, but it also would be good for my friends. And so I just told them it was a very classy event, and um, the guys wore tuxes, the girls wore long gowns, and, and I told them a little bit about what the um, Lisa Merlin House was all about and everything, and they all agreed it was very easy to get them. Wow, that's do it, very especially nice. Because it's so local, you know. Yeah, it is local, and actually, I think that everybody, I think everybody likes to dress up at one point or another. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? A good excuse to dress up and go out and mingle. Why not? Yeah. But anyway, great people, great people. Yeah, all yeah. professionals. Last year, when you, who, uh, who bought you, and what did you guys go get to do, or what, what exactly happened there? I want the gossip. I want all the, all the, all the, the good, the juicy the stuff. The scoop. Um, well, actually, all I, I uh, my package involved dinner and tickets for to Bush Gardens, and, okay. and and there was a little bit of a pricing bid war, and so two guys were going after it, and. Um, I just stopped. Um, they want with more cash one. Yeah, that's the way it works, I suppose. <laughs> but um, yeah, so that was that was about it. I met him, thanked him a little bit, and then he took the package and left. <laughs> that was okay. Look, I think that guy was crazy. But that's me, that's me. Crazy Joe that's what I say. It's about buying a package. That is correct. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you very much, Martha. Thank and you. Um, nice it's it's been a pleasure, my pleasure okay. actually. Thank you. Okay. What exactly did you feel last year when, when you were like the, the highest bid on the show? Well, I thought it was a good cause that, you know, we're going to raise a lot of money for great charity. And I was very happy that the communities come out to support the Lisa Merlin House. And what, okay, who, who asked you to do this and what did you think when they asked you to, hey, can you walk the plank basically and, and have people bid on you? What did you think about that? Well, I thought... When they told me the cause and the uh, fact that it's raising money for a house for chemical dependency women and people that have been addicted to alcohol, I thought I'll do it because it's going to raise a lot of money for the Lisa Merlin house and I was happy. Very good. How much did they bet for you? It was over 2500 Wow. She raised 2500 bucks, man. That's a lot of money. That's very cool. And uh, what did you feel when you were actually walking down the runway? Well, I was, there were two people that were bidding on me and I thought, Keep the bidding going, you know, because all the money is going to a charity. Where did you get to go when you guys went on a date? We actually never went on the date, you but know? we're very good friends still. <laughs> he was a doctor, and his schedule was so busy he never really could take the date, but we've been friends for a year, and we've done other things together as friends. That's cool. That's cool. So at so least you kept the relationship good. going. Yeah, it's been fantastic. Very cool. Very cool. Well, thank you very much, madame. Okay. His name is David. <laughs> David... Last year for the Lisa Merlin House Bachelor Bachelorette Auction, he was the highest bidder last year. So, uh, the highest bidder, she must have been just one, you know, one great looking cookie, huh? Absolutely. This is the, this is the best event of the entire year. There is no better cause than the Lisa Merlin House. Lisa Merlin, Merlin is a fabulous woman. And uh, there, there's not a home like this anywhere in the country. And, and all of you out there, uh, you should be proud of Lisa Merlin House, and you should support this worthy cause. That's very good. So, so what happens when, when you bid? I mean, how does it work? So you sit in the audience. Well, no, ahead of time you get this book, right? You, you get a book. The, did you raise the little, the, the little heart up in the air? Or? Oh, wait, we'll get to that. Hold on, hold on. Let's see. So, so you come in here, and you get this little book that it lists, like, all the ladies' names. See, it lists all their names and, like, their statistics. And then you kind of, what, you kind of have an idea of who you want to bid on? Or do you generally just bid on everybody? How, how does it work? Well, you bid for the Lisa Merlin house, and the people are just secondary. And we're all here to have a good time. Okay. And, uh, you know, I met lots of uh, very nice people last year, 
Uh, I met uh, Jackie Pizzuto, who's one of the organizers of this event, and I know many uh, of the other organizers. I know Lisa Merlin, and this is just this is just a place to have a good time and really to you know to donate to a worthy cause. And if you can have a good time out of it, then there's nothing wrong with that. Why not? And that's what I say: donate, worthy cause. You got everything together. But I want to ask this gentleman a question because ever since we started this interview, I've been bothered by one fact. That is that he's got a teddy bear right next to his heart, and now he's hiding it. So why exactly do you have a teddy bear right there? Well, do you want the long version or the short version? Well, I think we better, we better go with the short version. Because all these lovely ladies and all these lovely men tonight, they're just, they're just beautiful people, and they're here for a good cause. And, and this teddy bear, what this teddy bear represents is, is it represents this event. And it represents all the good people at this, uh, at this event at the Lisa Merlin House in, in Orlando. And that's what this teddy bear represents. It represents love and peace and prosperity. That's very beautiful. Let me show it to the camera a little bit. Let's see. You see, it's got a little, little bandage and everything. So that's pretty cool. I think that's, uh, see, that's very nice. That's very nice. Thank you very much, Dave. I appreciate Thank you coming you. over. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Good luck. Good luck. We'll see you bidding out there. If you're enjoying the Michelle Valentine Show, you will love her new travel TV show, Love, Eat, Travel. Follow Michelle Valentine as she travels the world, showcasing the most beautiful destinations, unique adventures, romantic things to do, delicious foods, and more. Visit www.loveeattravel.tv for more information about her upcoming TV show. Hi, this is Michelle Valentine, and I would love if you followed me on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, Twitter, YouTube, and LinkedIn. Be sure to visit my website, michellevalentine.tv, for more information, read thousands of interesting blog posts, watch videos, enter sweepstakes, and more. Also, be sure to join my email list to receive my free weekly e-newsletter. Are you wondering where all the quality singles are? Singles that are attractive, educated, and financially secure? Hello, I'm Michelle Valentine, and I've helped thousands of singles live a happier life, and I can help you too. Clients and members include millionaires, models, doctors, lawyers, and teachers. So call us for your complimentary consultation.